Well, what happens if I take negative five times negative two? Well, here's what happened when I multiplied five times two. When I multiply negative five times negative two, I'm gonna do the same thing, but now I have to take that extra negative into account. And when I do that, my length is going to end up flipping over the zero and it becomes a positive 10. So negative five times negative two gives me positive 10. And the same thing happens when I do negative two times negative five. So the negative two times five brought me to negative 10, but when I take into to account that extra negative, my distance will flip over the zero and end up at positive 10. So negative two times negative five also equals positive 10.